Hello everybody, Drifty here from Driftwood Gaming, and this is going to be a special request video for Solan Barcelos. Hopefully I said your name right, uh, sorry if I didn't. Um, he's having uh, trouble with an item, and I, I can make this a uh, really quick video to show him how to do it. So he's saying, I have a problem, I want to do a gun weapon, which causes damage based on the agility of the character, something like agility times 4 minus the defense by, uh, times 2. But the thing is, I can only do this to skills, and I want it to be different, a different formula for each weapon. Can someone help me out with that? Well, it's really easy. All you have to do is install a plugin. The plugin you're going to need is, uh, it came with the DLC from, uh, if you got it from Steam. Uh, the weapon skill plugin. You could also find it online, um, but if you if you had the DLC from Steam and you don't know how to access that, you just go to your Steam library, go to properties, go to local files, and then you're going to browse local files, and then you're going to look for the DLC folder. And in there, you're going to go to Kadokawa plugins, I think that's the one, and you're going to find the weapon skill one. You're going to copy that, and you're going to put it into your game folder. If you're not sure where that's at, you go to game in your MV and you open folder and then it's the JS plugin. So you copy that file, you put it in here. Once you've done that, you're going to go to this puzzle piece here. You're going to double click on a free, split, uh, free slot and then you're going to go all the way down until you see weapon skills. It should be right there. Uh, once that's loaded, um, you can open it up and the help file will tell you how to use it. It's really short, but all you really need to do is go over here, highlight this, skill underscore ID. Uh, with a colon and a number, you press Control C to copy that because the right-click copy still doesn't work. Um, once you've copied that, you can go to your database, go to your weapons, and let's create that gun, Agility Gun. And I'm sure you have a much more creative name than that for, than I do, but uh, we'll just give it that little sniper rifle, and then we can say this weapon uses agility instead of attack. And then what we're going to do is we're going to paste that code that we put in there. Um, and what was that code again? Skill ID. Copy. Paste. So you're going to paste that in there. But the number is going to say 3 for you. But we're, we're not going to use that number. Because this number is actually calling on the number for a skill. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to the top here. You're going to copy your attack. And then you're going to go to the bottom. And you're going to change maximum if you need to. And you're going to go call this whatever you want agility gun skill or we can just call it gun attack and we'll give it whatever icon you want we'll just have the same one um, then we're gonna go to damage type HP damage and um, you could actually paste this and just rename it um, but if you didn't you can do it this way um, you're gonna use the same formula but instead of attack uh, a ATK times 4. This is what I would have copied minus B defense times 2. All you're going to have to do is change this ATK to AGI. So now your agility is going to be used. And since normal attacks can critical, you can say critical. You don't want it to cost any TP, but you want it to award 5 TP if you want to keep it with the standard. Uh, scope would be one enemy. Occasion would be battle screen only. You would set it to none because you're not going to actually award this skill. You're going to assign this skill to a weapon. So you don't actually have to give it anything. You need to change the hit type to physical attack unless you don't ever want it to miss. But then it might be OP. Change the animation to whatever you want. Um, I, would, I think there is a built-in gun one. Uh, where is it at? Shoot normal or something like that. Um, and you would just say uses or does gun attack, whatever you like. Um, and then you don't need to change anything else. But what you need to do is take note of where you put the gun attack. For you, it probably won't be on 196. Whatever number that your gun attack is on, you're going to take that number, go back to your uh, weapon, and put that number right after the skill ID. So for me, it was 196. But for you, it'll probably be something different. So you put that number... Uh, right there in the skill underscore ID semicolon or colon with the gun skill. You hit OK and you award your gun any way you want to with the treasure chest or however you're going to get it in the game. That's I'm sure you can figure that out. If you can't, uh, leave a comment and I'll, I'll show you how to do that. But that's just a real quick tutorial on how you can make a gun use agility instead of attack. I hope this video helped you, Solon Barcelos. 
And uh, if you have any more questions, leave a comment and I will get back to you. Thank you guys for watching. And if this helped you, please like, favorite, share, subscribe. Any of that will help me out and help the channel grow. And it will let me know that you guys are interested in this sort of thing. And I, I really uh, enjoy you guys asking me questions because you uh, teach me stuff too. So thank you guys for asking these questions. Thank you guys for watching this video. And we'll see you in the next tutorial.